in Mandarin is called the Jiu Jie Bianzi. Let's say the whole thing. Jiu Jie Bianzi. A nine section chain whip. Get a rope and a tennis ball and poke a hole in the tennis ball and then thread that rope through the tennis ball with a knot on the end. And that would be a great beginner's method of learning this weapon because then if you messed up and hit yourself in the face or in the head or in the elbow or in the groin, this way the tennis ball hits you and no harm, no foul. You'll be pretty safe. And you can get confidence with all the different moves before graduating to the actual weapon. And I want you to swing it underhand and catch the dart in your hand. So you're holding handle and dart together. I want to leave the flags on during this entire DVD series because it's going to help you guys to see where the dart is at any particular point in the spin. So for instance, this would be the wrong position. There's too much over here and not enough over there. It's got to be here so that there's one link on the left and one link on the right. Does that make sense? Okay, let's try it again. Neck and arm together. So it's right here, killed, relaxed. Then fling it off, reverse spin this way. What you can do at this point is you can take your whip and do an elbow change facing the other direction. But let's try it from four angles so you guys can see it from four different directions. left side and I suck it back. It's time to go to the next instructional video which is going to be teaching you a little bit of a Tao Lu or a form linking a lot of our spins and shoots together into a sequence.